Hey guys, um, this is Tokenawa, and uh, more of a serious video today. Um, have you guys ever known someone with cancer? Uh, someone who died of cancer, someone who's currently suffering from cancer? Well, um, I was perusing through my Facebook one day and came across this group that said, um, that basically we're talking about a cure for cancer. They said they found the cure for cancer, and uh, this is talking about um, a drug uh, called. I think it said it was dichloroacetate or something like that. Uh, uh, anyway, it's called DCA, right? Um, news have been have been um, calling it uh, a wonder drug and that it kills most cancers. Um, and I was just wondering what you guys thought about that. Um, there's also on the discussion boards there that, that it, there's different things to say. Well, the companies are really selfish because apparently what what these people think is that is that the um, the companies are stopping uh, the research into DCA because there is not enough evidence to suggest that it is actually a cure for cancer. Um, there's a lot of people with different biases out there and different and different viewpoints and different opinions. And I was just wondering about about yours. Um, basically, what the what the drug does is um, well, you need to know a little bit about the cells first. The cell has something called mitochondria in it, and it creates energy for the cell. Um, basically, what happens is cancer cells turn off their mitochondria. Mitochondria, um, as soon as the cell is faulty, it basically triggers the cell to die. So that's how our body bodies naturally combat against cancer. And what cancer is is basically just abnormal abnormal cell growth. Excuse me. Um, basically, what DCA does is it uh, sort of forces a turn on to the to the mitochondria in ca cancer cells, enabling the cancer cell to basically die. The mitochondria would just kill it. Um, initial testing, initial initial testing, has been proven that um, that basically it reduces the size of tumors, but it's never been really known to kill off kill off cancer so um, basically the argument is that the companies are being really selfish and caught up in money um, and they won't they won't invest any more money into the research because of because of the fact that the drug isn't ready yet so I was wondering what you guys thought because I know there's some people that some people that think well, it doesn't matter what kind of how much money is invested into it as long as someone ends up living because of it when otherwise they were terminal with cancer and would have died anyway. So basically what I'm trying to say is um, trying to get the discussion discussion going about about DCA. I know there's a lot of lot of viewpoint viewpoints out there and you myself I, I know I've been touched by cancer in some way, shape or form, so I'm sure a lot of you have, so um, Please either put some comments down, or, or some, or even make a video response to this. Uh, just giving your viewpoints on, on on this new development and what the pharmaceutical company should do, what we should do, and what you think about this drug. So, uh, thanks. I'll talk to you later. Bye.